Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I just filmed another video. So if I look exactly the same as another video that actually is gonna go up way before this, and you remember that video, comment down below <laughs> if you know what video it was that I looked the same in because I'm putting that up like ASAP and this is not going up ASAP. I'm so excited for this video. Oh, also I had lunch in between the videos which is why I don't have a lip product on anymore and I could not waddle my pregnant butt all the way upstairs to put a lip product on. So you're getting like, I don't know, sloppy seconds in terms of like filming like my hair and you know, not that you care because you're here for this little baby haul that I'm filming, which I'm so, so excited for. So this is, um I bought all this myself. None of this was sent to me. None of this is like sponsored or anything, but I'm super excited because I feel like these are kind of, like, I don't want to say like boutique, but maybe they are kind of boutique little places to get like baby accessories and clothes and things. And of course I'll have everything that I'm mentioning in this video listed down below in the description box for y'all to check out. I have some stuff from Kite Baby and then I also have some stuff from Posh Peanut, which I'm so excited about. I get like, I just get so much of my baby clothes and all his like toys and swaddles and blankets and all that stuff I just get so much of that from kind of your standard places I feel like like Target and Bye Bye Baby and Old Navy and like all those kinds of places and I feel like these are a little bit lesser known definitely like higher quality higher price tag definitely a little bit more pricey and definitely a lot nicer than a lot of the stuff that's just you know Carter's and this is the Cloud 9 brand from Target they're definitely like a little bit of a level up and you can tell by how they feel and I'm so so excited to have snagged a bunch of stuff it's honestly not a ton of stuff so hopefully we won't be here for too long I also need to get all this stuff washed which is another reason I'm very excited to be filming this so I can throw all this stuff in the wash I'm gonna start with posh peanut just because there's only like three things from there I don't know a lot of people that have shopped there I honestly like never heard about it until very recently okay <laughs> He's so big now that when he moves, I literally have to like stop what I'm doing to make sure I can breathe. Okay, I just date, so he's probably really excited. But I feel like Posh Peanut is definitely lesser known than Kite Baby, so I wasn't like 100% sure. It just seemed like it was really, really cute. So I only grabbed a couple things just to kind of try out, but I'm super excited. So the first thing, you know, since we're having a little fall baby is this little, I guess it's a gown, but the reason I was really excited about this is because it's like a zippered gown. So I feel like it's almost kind of like a swaddle, like it's kind of got swaddle vibes in the sense that you can unzip it from the bottom, but it's also kind of a gown and then kind of a knotted gown style, but without the knot, it's got like a zipper instead of the knot. So I thought that was just like real, real different. And like all their stuff is so nice. Like even the zipper has their little PP like logo. They have their little tags. Like I just feel like there's a lot of attention to detail. This this is their logo and like the tag and stuff. Like I said, I wasn't really like super familiar with them, but the material is butter, butter, butter soft and like kind of that really stretchy, bouncy, feels really good. And I love that this just zippers. So that obviously makes a diaper changes super, super convenient. This is a zero to three month. And honestly, I feel like this looks very small, like kind of very narrow but it is kind of stretchy and obviously he's not here yet so i cannot like even pretend to be like an expert on exactly like what size babies are <laughs> at what stages i also just noticed they also have like their little logo kind of like mixed into the print as well i thought this was so fall this is super gender neutral as well i feel like this could be for a girl or a boy it's just very much like a beginning of the school year or like obviously fall picking apples and apple pie and all that with the yellow and the green i just thought it was very fall vibes and obviously he's gonna be a fall baby so i thought this was perfect Perfect. I also love the little buttons. They are actually functional, which I didn't realize. Like, they're really nice wood. I just think it's really nice. It feels good quality. It's super, super long. I don't even know if you can tell. It's, it's pretty long. I feel like the legs would stop like quite a bit before they would like reach the bottom, especially at this size. And also it has little fold over mittens, which I feel like is super important, especially like when they're super, super baby. I'm super excited. I might even bring this to the hospital because I feel like this would just be so convenient for like easy access. And then they have little like lovey blankets that they sell that you can attach. It doesn't come with anything attached to it like you'll see with the kite baby. And I decided to do like the mystery one because I really wanted one. I couldn't really decide which one I wanted. Wanted, and the mystery one was like on a sale and I couldn't really pick so I was like, you know I'm just gonna gamble and do the mystery one and you couldn't pick a gender when you did that So I totally knew I was risking getting a girly one and I did but I love it Which is I mean I'm having a boy, but I'm kind of obsessed with it y'all look at this print Tell me this is not like the coolest thing you've ever seen 
I mean, it's definitely very, he's being born in October. So it's definitely like Halloween vibes with the skeletons and the flowers. And then obviously it's got like little pumpkins. It's very much a fall print for sure. And it's just kind of on like a blue background. And then it is double-sided. So this is just kind of like a rosy mauvey pink with stripes. So it's definitely, I think it would be considered a girl lovey. But I'm obsessed with this. I literally just kind of want to keep this <laughs> like for myself and like maybe just attach it to something because it does have the little, this is obviously how you like make it a lovey. You put the pacifier or like a little wooden ring or whatever through the hole and that's how you can attach it to something. But I also feel like you could use this just as like a little security blanket for them to hold on to. Even like a super tiny little burp cloth or just kind of like a rag. Just kind of like an all purpose thing, which is I think what I might use it for. Like just kind of throw it in my diaper bag and kind of use it as like and everything like if I need to wipe my hands if I need to wipe some spit up I just feel like this could be super versatile and it's again that really nice like bouncy stretchy material it is like double lined like these are two separate materials I love this material so much I don't even know if this print is on the website this might be like only available as like a mystery option. I can't, I'm obsessed with that. And then the last thing I picked up, which was like the main reason for this order, if y'all know anything about me, like anything, even just from like following me on social media, <laughs> or obviously if you know me in person, cheese fries, like french fries in general, cheese fries in particular, but just french fries are my reason for living and they're basically everything to me. So when I saw this set, I literally had to buy it. It was like not an optional thing. So I don't even know if you can tell, it says it obviously the swaddle and beanie set. I don't even remember what size. I mean, obviously swaddles aren't necessarily any particular size. I also like this packaging. Obviously I just took the beanie out. This would be so good for gifting. The fact that it's kind of like already in a really nice presentation. And actually I didn't even take it out yet. Obviously as you can tell, but it just like slides out. It's got this really nice like little pull ribbon really 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 nice packaging okay this is zero to three months so this will be kind of a younger baby type thing too but <laughs> how funny is this little beanie it's obviously not one of the knotted ones it's just kind of like a regular little cap but i love the little fry print i love that it's red this is just like a swaddle blanket so it doesn't have you know any like velcro or anything on it it's just like a big giant receiving blanket which again these are so handy and so versatile you can literally use these for everything they can be a car seat cover they can be like a little tummy tummy that they can be an actual swaddle blanket they can be a car seat blanket a stroller blanket you can use these for everything but obviously swaddling him up in this with a matching hat would just i'm gonna die it's going to be <laughs> so cute like any child of mine would need something like this. I just think that's the cutest little set. Those are the only three things I grabbed from them, but I'm definitely very, very impressed. I love the quality. I kind of like, as you can tell, got like a little bit of everything, like something wearable, some accessories, just so I could test it out. And I'm very impressed and very excited. So now I'll move on to Kite Baby. Like I said, I'll have all this stuff linked down in the description box for y'all to check out. They obviously have a ton of colors and patterns and like different styles of everything. This <laughs> doesn't look like cute. It's just in a FedEx package, but this is from Kite Baby, which I feel like you've probably more likely heard of there. I feel like a lot of like influencers and stuff work with them like on social media, but I got a good amount of stuff from them. They're definitely on the pricey side, like 100%. If you can get a good sale or like a coupon code or something, it makes Makes it <laughs> a little bit easier to uh, to process. That's the one thing about baby stuff that it's just like it makes it so hard to spend. You know, even like a little bit more than like the old navy target price because hey, it's probably gonna get spit up on or pooped on, and it's they're gonna wear it like only a couple times. I feel like before they grow out of it. But I feel like at the same time, when it comes to nicer quality pieces like this, they're things that you can use for many children. And also, if we have a girl next. She's kind of beat. She's going to be wearing all of this. I mean, all that Posh Peanut stuff was gender neutral for the most part. Obviously, like, besides the lovey. This Kite Baby stuff... I mean, it's gender neutral in the sense that it's just solid colors, but it's like blues and greens. So again, blues and greens can obviously be gender neutral. I feel like it's easier to like put a girl in blue stuff than to put a boy <laughs> in like pink stuff. So I feel like if we have a daughter, she's going to be stuck in a lot of blue stuff, which she'll just have to deal. But I actually got another like lovey type product from a Kite Baby. This is the packaging that it comes in. I obviously took it out already. So it's the same kind of concept as this one from Posh Peanut but with Kite Baby they have it already on kind of just like a little wooden teether ring and it's actually branded 
right up there which is nice and this is really like nice quality really solid and very smooth it's obviously like kind of a deeper hunter green really again nice quality not the same in the sense of these are like that really thin bouncy very soft material this is a lot thicker still like very very soft and smooth definitely not stretchy or bouncy but definitely this is like multi multi layered I think you can even tell it's sort of got like a quilted effect so it is like this section is separate from this section it's not just one blanket I feel like it's actually kind of like patchwork sewn and then the back is just kind of another layer this is very thick I feel like this would be very absorbent so again if you ended up taking it off the ring or even if you need to use this for like a little bit of spit up or like clean up on aisle two this would totally work for that obviously you can remove it and throw it in the wash super easily I love this color I think this color is pretty gender neutral very fall but also very kind of like Christmassy and wintry I feel like it's definitely gonna fit the season it's just a stunning color so so soft and honestly a really nice size as well that's what the branding like the logo for Kai baby is so nice and then this is just a plain swaddle blanket I think they have like similar blankets that are like really big like I think they're a similar material and stuff just like full-size blankets but this one is a swaddle size and this is much much closer to like the material of pretty much all the posh peanut stuff the really stretchy bouncy kind of thinner material which is obviously especially important when it comes to swaddles so that you can like really stretch it out and get like a really nice tight wrap really really soft and comfy so there's really nothing like too exciting about this one I just kind of got this turquoisey blue but I think this is just a really really pretty shade again I feel like this could be gender neutral this is gigantic even folded in half this is still really really big so I just feel like these receiving blankets have so many purposes in addition to swaddling which is what makes them you know really worth purchasing and kind of having a couple of because you can use them for anything even a burp cloth if you're in a pickle these will typically be decently absorbent and then you can just throw them in the wash and these next couple of things I tried to do <laughs> I tried to do all like similar colors and sort of do like sets but things were also like selling out I like definitely was not really efficient with checking out so I didn't end up with everything in my cart which I was so bummed because I had a little sloth hat that I didn't even know kite baby like had sloth stuff and I wasn't able to snag that that one they only had a couple left I think it said like low in stock and then it sold out before I checked out which I was so bummed about but speaking of like little animals I thought this was adorable so these actually come I think I took a video so I'll put on the screen here but these come wrapped up super super cute like kind of in a roll and then they put like a little ribbon on them with the tag so it's also just like again attention to detail and packaging and all that I'm a huge fan of especially with stuff like this that you might be wanting to gift so if you're watching this whether it's for you or you're considering like getting some stuff for a friend or for a baby shower all of this comes very very giftably <laughs> if that's a word, wrap, even the swaddle. But this is just a little burp cloth. Obviously, this is the same kind of like hunter green color. And I love this color. I literally like can't get enough of it, even for myself, but especially for my son, I'm so obsessed. And it just has little elephants on it. And I like the contrast with like the back and the like border, the piping being the green and it kind of like matching the elephants, but it's like a white background. I like the contrast of that. I just think that's so different. And I feel like so many people are really into elephants or maybe they're even doing kind of an elephant or like safari theme for the nursery. This would be such a cute gift. And this is just a little burp cloth. I don't know if I even said that. It's definitely a good size. And again, it's the same kind of like really stretchy bouncy material it has like two layers so it'll definitely be at least decently absorbent and then kind of <laughs> sticking with like this theme of all these greens like I said I was kind of trying to do a a color scheme to some degree I got a little <laughs> knotted hat I feel like you can never have enough of these just because they're so stinking cute he is gonna be born in the fall and then obviously you know be very young throughout the fall and winter so I think especially when we like take him places and even probably just around the house we're gonna want to probably put a hat on him just to make sure he's warm enough so this is just one of those simple knotted hats and this is like totally adjustable the knots in these so you could knot it you know and make it a little bit tighter or a little bit smaller or move the knot a little bit up it's pretty much the same material just so buttery soft and smooth really stretchy this material is just so nice so breathable and then I also got <laughs> I'm so obsessed with these little bandana bibs not just from kite baby obviously but just in general I just think the style of them is so cute I realize I still have the tags on like some of this stuff and some of it I don't 
need to remember to take these off <laughs> before I throw these in the wash. This is like one of the nicest bibs I have purchased. I really have to say these are so, so super thick, like crazy thick. The material on the outside, again, this is another, <laughs> this is like the fourth installment in this like little color series. It's the same material on the outside here, but that's just kind of a layer over this really, really thick, like I can't even tell you how thick and soft and cozy this terry cloth is. I would, if this was like on the inside of a sweatshirt or something, I would be so cozy. It's really, really soft, really like thick. And I don't know if you can tell, but the way that this is stitched, see how it kind of has this little like lip that goes over the like lining where it's actually sewn. So it doesn't even like look just like your normal kind of scoop bib. It almost like purposely has that sort of more like slouchy kind of bandana look. It just looks like there's some folded up material. You can't actually see the sewn seam of the bib. Just a little attention to detail like that. It's just gonna make it look a little bit nicer and cuter on your baby and it does have two buttons so you do have the two different size options to do it a little tighter a little looser it has the two on both sides and honestly i think these are just cute as like accessories like even if your kid is just kind of like hanging out i feel like especially a little boy i feel like with one of these they just look so cute but of course little girls as well and you can kind of see they have a little branded label there on the outside i'm obsessed with that i love it and i just love that i have like all these little matching things i think it would be so cute to put them like in the hat with the bib on and then again because I feel like bibs are just gonna be so necessary especially during like the teething drooling phase and because these are just so dang nice I had to pick up another one so I just got this again this is pretty gender neutral kind of like a lighter like bluish teal kind of color exactly the same I can't get over how thick these feel I honestly feel like out of everything in this haul even though everything is so nice this is one of the most thickest like durable feeling items I just love this color I just feel like, again, this will be such a cute little, like, outfit accessory edition, but also will serve a purpose as well. And then lastly, I just have two more things. They don't, like, come together, but I sort of got them to go together. And it's a little hat and a little <laughs> sleep sack. The hat is exactly the same as the green one that I showed y'all. It's the same, like, listing and the same style. This is just a smaller size. This would be, again, kind of more of a newborn, like, first couple months sort of hat. Just such nice quality material. I seriously can't get over it. But then I feel like what Kite Baby is most known for is their like sleep sacks, sleep bags. I feel like they are just like really, really hyped up. And honestly, for good reason, that was why I like wanted to make this purchase in the first place was because everyone was just raving about these sleep bags. And they do have a bunch of different togs. This is just a one. I think they have a 0.5 and then a two. I don't know if they have a 1.5, which obviously that just has to do with like the thickness and the warmth level. These are crazy, crazy, crazy nice quality. I obviously got this blue, which matches the little hat. So I feel like that would be such a cute like little picture opportunity, a little vibe. But this is so nice. As you can probably tell, this is like massively long. Like <laughs> you can't even hardly see in the frame how long this is. And I think you can even just tell by looking at it, the quality, like just how these are constructed. Again, it sort of has that quilted pattern and then it has like the little zipper protector to cover up the zipper so the zipper obviously starts up there if you want to like completely unzip it and it kind of goes i think you can tell it goes kind of like down the middle and then kind of wraps around the side but you can also unzip it from over here so the zipper has like one on each end which is what i love about this and i feel like is what everyone loves about this you can also just unzip it from the bottom so if you just need access to his little legs in the middle of the night to do a diaper change you can just unzip that and obviously like move it up and then zip it back up and you don't have to be unzippering and moving things around their head and their face and kind of like bother them or wake them up too much or anything so i feel like that's one of like the biggest perks about these is that they are very accessible but these are also just such again high quality like you really feel like you're getting what you pay for they're just really thick like there's a lot of layers to this obviously depending again on what like tog level you get it literally feels like a sleeping bag which i know is is what it is but it's just that thick and it just feels like it's gonna be like really warm but still super super comfortable and these obviously they can use for months and months and months and months and months they're gonna have plenty of room in the legs like again i feel like their legs will come nowhere near <laughs> the actual bottom of this so they'll have a lot of room for it to move and for them to like kind of move their legs around a little bit without feeling too constrained this is like what kite baby is known for <laughs> i feel like i had to grab one of these and they really seem like they're worth the hype i'm so excited about all this stuff i know this like wasn't very much stuff and i said i was gonna try to keep this short and i don't think i did that i always have that intention i always have that goal to just like kind of get through stuff and then 
just get excited and I want to like just chat about all these things and thoroughly explain how excited I am about them and what I love about them and then we end up being here for a lot longer than I intend but I hope that y'all enjoyed like I said everything will be linked down below and definitely let me know if you are like more familiar with these brands what some of your favorite products are specifically posh peanut because I just don't hear a lot about them and don't know a lot about them. give me all the recommendations as a new mom I definitely <laughs> I definitely need them thank you all so much for watching I hope that you enjoyed if you would like to subscribe we would love to have you we have so much fun here and until next time I will see y'all in our next video bye guys <laughs>